here with Ecucut Craft. Something super exciting I wanted to show you. Uh, if you're familiar with convertibles, we have convertible cards and we have convertible album covers. But this is, is very unique. This album uh, was designed by Cheryl Mazzetti for us. And uh, it's, it's really unique and fun to use. And I wanted to show you uh, the different um, dies that you can buy to go with this series. So let me quick show you. You can do the album cover, so it has a little scallop on the side, and then here's the convertible piece, and I'll show you how that works in just a second. And then here are, um, this set is called the Springs, Spring Convertible Set. So in this set, even though they're all different shaped dies, you get this long cut that has um, a frame, two frames, one has a kind of fancy teardrop shape on the corner, and then a butterfly and a flower, which, I already made just some plain cuts so that you can kind of see how this works. So here is the butterfly, um, here is the butterfly convertible, and so when you put it inside of this opening, of the opening, and you can put it a couple different ways depending on how, um, if you're going to do vertical or horizontal with your album. So here is this butterfly convertible, and so I already cut it out of a front page. So one of the little tiny butterflies cuts out, and this other butterfly stays in, and you just simply bend him up to, to give some dimension. So that's super cute. And then um, with that same series, um, with this same series, you also um, get the teardrop-shaped frame. So I've cut that out right here. Let me show it to you. So I've cut this out. And the great thing you're like, so you, you get the, the negative is kind of left over. And then, so then you can cut out the frame and actually frame it right over the cut in the album. Or you can use this frame all on its own. Um, on scrapbook pages, other albums, note cards. Um, so that's a really cute one. The butterfly is to accent. So he also doesn't cut all the way out so you can bend his little wings up like this. And that's what I did, you can see, on this little journal cover. So I cut out the butterfly, and so that's what you see here. And then I added this as an accent on the cover. So it's meant to be able to use throughout the album when you use this. Or, another, I mean, this would be beautiful on, the, on a favor box or on a card or in other craft projects too. So the other one is going to be the flower. And that is what I did here. So I cut this out of the album. Um, the flower shape and then I use the accent flower which is here on the front and then I also used it back here and then I used it for um, fun accents all the way in the in the album and the little square frame right here I used inside the album and I also used it goes perfectly around um, the edge of my opening for um, this this uh, convertible piece which is the flower so love that set, but we have another one too. And so this one is the spring set, four die set. And then we have just the frame set. So you get three cool frames. And then two convertible inserts, one a rectangle, one a square. And they, they basically coordinate with these frames. So again, you can put, use the convertible either way in the album, and then here I'll show you the cuts that I used already. So here's the rectangle and the square, and I can do them vertical or horizontal. And then these frames coordinate, so if you want to put a frame on the outside, I know it's white, but you, but you can coordinate all these, and here's the square one from the spring set, but it also coordinates with these. So. Um, as I said, you can use these throughout your album. You can use them, um, and then here's the tangle frame. I somehow misplaced it. But then you can also use this cool, fancy rectangle frame around the rectangle shapes. So let me just recap. There's three different dies. You can, you can do just the simple um, album, and then with that, you can purchase the spring convertible set, 
or the frames convertible set and then do so many things with them and um, as I said it can be vertical or horizontal um, it's a must-have mm -hmm.